Oh, jeepers. Boys, strap in. A person who thought people could believe once again. A person who joined the community. Collected some skins based on stories that he told. Making people feel bad. Just to fuck them over. In the world of Twitter and Twitch, there exists a con artist who operates under the disguise of a struggling sad individual, but in reality, he man man manipulates and deceives his followers Habibi for personal gain. And it's not only a pixel baby. that he's talking about, thankfully. I didn't get exposed yet. This manifesto aims to shed a light on the actions of JXS, similar to JKS, by the way. Coincidence? I don't know. Revealing his true nature and urging others to recognize the deception. The money he has received from his fans and supporters for a new PC he has been he has used for an iPhone 15. <laughs> Bro, I have an iPhone from three years ago. My blood bought a 15. My fucking scamming his friends. That is crazy. And gambled the rest away from multiple sources over $2,000. All info included. Here's the dog with more information. His dog died. Rest in peace. But poor dog that he had a fucked up owner because the owner used that as fucking sympathy gaining points. Um... Just to fuck people over. Like, oh, uh, I'm depressed. He used this as, as a fucking signal. Made people feel bad. People sent him money. My mm -hmm, ass gambled away the entire Twitch payout. Trying to get more. He started streaming. People felt bad. They started donating things. They started uh, uh, supporting him. Also selling gifts. I don't know. That's kind of weird. But that's just my opinion. I think this is all right. If it's a gift, it's a gift. Would I ever sell a gift? No. Apart from that one time where I quick sold one to open a case. Sorry, Xerpas, that was a mistake. Yeah, I'm not a fan of it, but I think this is fine. I think this is fine. Um, a gift is a gift, you know. It's uh, the guy can do whatever he wants with it. Finally we need some. No, no, no. There's a lot of work. deeper stuff. I don't know. He told me. Uh, so okay, le let me break it down. JXS. I think the account is now gone. Yeah. He basically joined the community recently, ish. Started and did the classic started posting about skins had a decent collection had a decent inventory made friends with people in the community Yeah, um and on twitter you can pretty easily find a fucking grip and connect with other people Um that are into skins build a decent following um we've seen this many many times But this is one of the times where the guy used that to fuck people over Yeah, he gained a decent following started streaming on twitch as I said gained sympathy points with with his, his dog who died rest in peace was 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 begging for stuff in other channels as well. I remember. I think there was a story between him and um, Super F as well. Where's the tweet that, which condensed it nicely? Here, exit scammer JXS was not as fresh on the scene as he had once made out. Upon doing some digging, I've discovered once went under the name of Glockito. Wait, what? I didn't know this. No, 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 guys. We started. Got to start at the roots. Greetings to. We got to start at the Discord. roots. This is the original tweet. Yeah, this is the one. I'm sorry to an this is this was to everyone's surprise. I'm sorry to this was after he already borrowed skins from 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 his friends, from his viewers, from his fans, or uh, uh, got gifts and stuff. I'm sorry to announce that JXS has announced to exit scam in DMs. We had hours, which is a guy who has the last mod left on his Discord. Message him, and he openly admitted to selling the skins he was lent. Goatycat landed him a lightning strike .01 float pattern 364 and he sold it. Item history, he lent it to JXS, JXS sold it. Bang. Here are the logs to prove it. Bruv borrowed 20k USD at one time, Pandora's field tested, Black Pearl Stiletto, F and Hydroponic, Butterfly Fade and stuff. Do you think I would exit scam for such a low amount, which everyone is saying I've scammed? I've returned all of it. If I'm not mistaken, you had shit of mump cats, right? You mean you returned that or old stuff? I want me to be completely honest with you. I had an orb lightning strike from cat, which I sold. I owe a lot of money from loans. I sold most of my CS inventory to pay a small part of what I own. Uh, of what I owe, I think he means. Again. And in that mix, I sold Katz's as RVP. It was enough for them to give me a month extra. I still have Mumps AK. I know it's wrong and I shouldn't have done it. He claimed that he... This is for me interesting because this is so crazy to me, bro. A person who is, who is loved by his fans, who has people... I think he had... He averaged around like 50 viewers, 65 viewers, which is enough to make a good living if you're a CS content creator, actually. If you do want to go the route of like, if you need to make a living, you take a gambling sponsor yeah. and you can pay your bills. If you have 100 viewers, 50 viewers, actually, literally. Is it ethical? No. But uh, uh, <laughs> scamming <laughs> seems to be, I don't know, a little bit more unethical in my opinion. And then he just exit scams out his fucking community, bro. And his friends. He claimed that he would repay people, but let's be real. If we were to lend a skin, would you want that skin back or money back? The loan people were on my neck. By the way, I think this is cap. 
And after selling almost my whole, like Blood thinks he's in a movie with fucking loan sharks or what. And after selling almost my whole inventory, the orb was enough to pay for now so they could give me some more time. You will find out why I think this is sus in a bit. Because he may have spent that money on some, maybe trying to multiply it, get the max. Do you think I wanted to do that? Do you think I feel good? Bro, quit the bullshit. You may have IRL debt and people bothering you, but there's no excuse for this. Don't try and say, do you think I wanted to do that? Yes, I do think that. Because you did it. I can offer to pay it back, but it will take some time. I never said I wasn't planning on returning it. Everything got blown out of proportion before I could do anything. It takes 10 seconds to send a trade offer. You could have just returned them and addressed the other stuff. Didn't have to sell the skins. I didn't sell the RVP today. It was a few days ago. Bang, RVP lightning strike, sold, 500 fucking dollars. Are you happy now? Once again, I apologize to everyone who was affected by the situation. JX has showed his true colors, and this just goes to show how you must be more careful when lending items, even when you feel like the person in question can be trusted or has too much to lose. JX has been playing the victim card, but this unacceptable behavior. If you're a victim, please reach out to me, blah, blah, blah. Heads up, just got noticed that the JXX is currently selling everything on CS Float. Yo, no. What's crazy to me as well, now I think again of the scammer mentality, bro. L exit scam. My blood could have fucking at least 10x exit scammed. My blood exit scammed how much? A thousand bucks? No, oh, bro, you could have easily got fucking 10k out of that. Got me mixed up. That's an L scam right there. Heads up, just got noticed that Jax is currently selling everything on CS Float. His inventory is going empty. He's officially given up. I'm not sure if all of those skins were gifted, bought by him or lent to him, but this is over. Vickle bought everything. We are going to give it back to the people. Damn. Claps in the chat. Claps in the chat. Well, ladies and gentlemen, no more cash outs since JXS literally got banned from Float. <laughs> got banned on Float. People were fucking mass reporting him on rap as well. Got banned on CS rap. I don't think he got banned on Steam though. Please look into these scammed items being sold. Blah, blah, blah. Shut the fuck up, you fucking He bitch. borrowed the Pandoras Shut and shit off me. Gave it back but tried to get more items right before he sold off. Oh. LOL was his first subscription on Twitch as well. Dude. Is it just me though, bro? I swear on God, I would never fall for people like this, bro. I swear, I swear on God, I have a good sensor, bro. I swear, bro, I swear. He seemed sus since the first second. I'm not even kidding. I knew. <sighs> Fuck, man. If, look. This guy was his first subscriber, and he tried to milk the cow. JXX censored his Discord and deleted every channel people could text in. He also banned people that were mods of lent him skins. <laughs> there was a warning sent out on JXX's Discord, which he deleted after two minutes to suppress the people from knowing what's going on. If you have lent him any skins, blah, blah, blah. <clears throat> LOL. Dude, what? But where's the thing? Because also one post proved that he was gambling away some of the skins. Or like he said that. <clears throat> Is it this? Breaking news, XS Gamma JSS was not as flesh to the scene as he had once made out. Upon doing some digging, I've discovered that JXS was once Glockito, a CSGO YouTuber who made videos on Spanish. Managed to gain 11k subs, making videos gambling and cheating in legitimate lobbies. Looking at JXS's alt account in Steam Letter shows a previous alias from 2017. What is that? LOL? I have not seen this. Upon putting that name into Steam, you can find several accounts VAC ban, including one with Road to Global with hacks in its username. How does that link to JXS, you ask? Well, the account shown here has a main account link that leads to an account called JXS. Putting the name Glockito into YouTube lands on a channel that has 730 subscribers with a bio that translates to channel with 11k subs called Glockito. Closed by YouTube for no reason. I've attached a video below of one of his gambling videos that isn't private. Don't speak much Spanish. From what I've gathered, it's a video asking people to use as a referral code. Interesting, bro. Interesting. Ah, okay, this, so this was his old f***ing him. But he knows that people on f***ing Twitter, the Twitter skins guys, they, they, they hate shit like that. So he just f***ing got a new f***ing personality. Interesting. My man started a new life on Twitter. <clears throat> Damn, and then he exit scammed over there. That's crazy.